Hello and welcome back to Overbooked. I'm Amanda and today I'm gonna to be going over my favorite five book covers of 2019. I know they always say don't judge a book by its cover but you know we all secretly do. Like if a book has a cool cover I'm gonna pick it up and read the back. So let's get creative in our book covers people. Like let's do them up. Do them up. Okay. In no particular order let's get started. Okay the first book I have is If They Come For Us by Fatima Asagar. I can't, you guys know I'm terrible with pronouncing names, but um, this is a collection of poetry and it's um, written by a Pakistani Muslim. And all this poetry is conveying her feelings of growing up in America as a Pakistani Muslim and what that has done and her experiences and her feelings, her emotions and going through all that stuff. And it was a very beautiful work of poetry. I loved it and I'm not usually into poetry. I usually don't get much out of it and I really loved it and it was really good. So if you haven't read that book of poetry, I really highly recommend it. So the next one is Home Fire by Camila Shamsi. And this was about a British Muslim family and how they have to deal with growing up in Britain and dealing with like racism and um, just also dealing with their own personal family matters and sibling relationships and love and heartbreak. And it was a really, really, really beautiful book. Very sad, very heartbreaking, but I really, really enjoyed it. And the cover is beautiful. And what else can you, what else can you want? It was just great. Next book is Sugar Run by Mesha Marin. And this was a, another beautiful cover and beautiful book, very well written. Um, it takes place in the Appalachia and it centers around a woman who is sent to jail when she's like a teenager or like she's in her early 20s or something. And then she gets out 30 years later or 20 years later and just her trying to readjust to life, how she wants to get back into society and also falling in love with somebody and who also is a hot mess. And it was just a really, really good book. It also, I think, played a really, or pointed out a really important thing is that a lot of people who come out of prison, especially who people who go to prison so young, and then they come out and they don't really have any skills or um, experience to rely on to get a job because you know they've spent a lot of their time in prison and no one will hire them. So it was really heartbreaking to watch as she, like they have like a lot of parts in the book are like her just trying to go to a store and then once they hear that she's been in prison, they don't want to hire her or she's not qualified and all of that stuff. And it's just really um, eye-opening and angering because obviously we want people to be reformed after or have um, a good life after they get out of jail or prison, but it's really not the case a lot of the times. And, um, that was my, that was my rant, but it was a very good book. So then we have The Great Believers by Rebecca, Rebecca Mackay. Loved this book, beautiful cover, beautiful story. Um, we follow a gay man living in Chicago during the eighties, during the AIDS epidemic and just follow him and then follow one of his close friends in present time and going back and forth between the times and just learning about this time in history through their eyes was just amazing. I can't recommend it anymore. I also have a review on it. Check it out if you want. And then lastly, The Nickel Boys by Colson Whitehead. I don't think this like cover is crazy or there's not, there's not a lot going on, but I loved how like simple it is. Like I just loved the, the big red box and then the two boys in like the little corner and I just really was drawn to it and I really loved it and I love this book and if you haven't read it, go do it now. Okay, so that was it. That was all the covers that I thought were the best of 2019. The most beautiful, the most eye-catching for me. Um, I really enjoy a good, cool cover art for a book. That was really fun. In the comments below, let me know what your favorite covers are for your book or your favorite book covers are, um, especially for 2019 or just in general, overall. I would love to know and make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys next time.